I. This is how you can calculate the percentages for multiple rows and columns in Excel. In this scenario, we have the grand total for a bunch of app. We have the total for the app. Then we need to get the percentage. To do that, equals F2 divided by F5. It enter equals F3 divided by F5. It enter. But that's stressful. Let me show you a much more easier way. We'll go back to the cell and delete them. Go back to the first cell equals f2 divided by f5 just before you press enter i want you to press the f4 on your keyboard then hit enter like that i can easily drag my formula down and get my results boom then you can change it to a percentage and the function of the f4 key is that it fixes f5 so i always reference f5 in my formula when i drag the formula down you can cross check and see f5 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 a little bit cost check out equals then we get 100 percent so let's take it a little bit further and calculate the percentage for multiple rows and columns in this case rather than looking at a bunch of numbers like we have here we want to look at them in percentage for each quarter for each app then we want to divide this cell divided by the word by the grand total for each app then we can go to equals this divided by the total but wait just before pressing enter just press the F4 key on your keyboard twice. One, two, three. And hit enter. And there we can easily drag to the right and drag down. Then we can change it to a percentage here. Yeah. Then we can quickly cross check out equals enter. Then you can just drag down to confirm. And the purpose of pressing F4 twice is just that it fixes the column F and makes sure the rows is what is relative, is moving down. So I can easily drag to the right like this, which is see referencing column F, this total for what for the game map. So when I drag down the cells shift down, you can see this is F3. That means the 3 can shift down from 2, 3, 10 to 4. Find this useful, give it a thumbs up and follow for more.